This is Mike Callahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome to your Buttersnatch.com tutorial on how to use Opera Mini on your Android phone. For those of you who are a fan of Opera on your desktop, Opera Mini is available for Android. You can get it here in the Android market. It's free. Just download it. We'll tap it. It has a handy start screen. comes preloaded with some things. My Opera, Opera Sports, tap on butterscotch you can see the butterscotch site is loading now if you tap the wrench icon down here on the end there are a number of things you can deal with downloads history bookmarks saved pages you can look for things in a page get help check your start page and go into settings if you go into settings there are all manner of things that you can deal with Loading images, image quality. You can go into advanced settings. Here you can also notice that there's mobile view, full screen. Opera link can be on or off. You can also tap privacy. Let's do that. And you see here, I have it set to remember passwords and accept cookies. And not to clear the history or passwords or cookies. Now, if I tap the X next to clear history, I get a little reminder message. You are about to clear your entire browsing history. Do you wish to continue? Well, I'll say no. So here you can configure Opera Mini to behave the way you want it to. Now, if you tap the papers here to the left of the wrench icon, you'll see it brings up the web page that we're displaying, Butterscotch, I can tap the plus, and I'll tap two cows, and essentially what it's doing now is it's loading multiple pages. So you see there's two cows, and you notice down here there's a two, which means that I have two windows open. Now if I tap that again, you see it brings up both of my pages so I can toggle back and forth. If I want, I can open a third page. We'll do the New York Times. And now you see I have the New York Times. There's a three down here to tell me how many pages I have open. I can tap the three. I have access to all the pages I have open. And if I want, I can close one just by tapping the red X in the corner. So this is Opera Mini on the Android phone. It's very impressive, has some very nice features. And that's all there is to it. 